government on its part has instituted a number of measures to prevent cybersecurity breaches, such as the en enactment of the Cybersecurity Act in 2020 and the adoption of a national cybersecurity policy. Additionally, government continues to empower and also to equip the Cybersecurity Authority and the National Signals Bureau, which are mandated to effectively monitor and regulate the country's cyberspace to enable them to identify threats to our cyberspace and also to deploy requisite measures to counter same. While government continues to fulfill its duty to citizens by ensuring the security and stability of our territory and the people within, it is important, extremely important, that the actions of the state towards the aforesaid objective would be incomplete without the active participation of citizens. And this we must all bear in mind. Various studies have revealed that an estimated 90% of cyber attacks were attributable to human error, indicating that mistakes caused by human beings were the most common means through which cyber crimes occurred. And the theme for this year's launch therefore sheds light on a crucial aspect in our fight against cybercrime, which, of course, is the role of the private sector. While cybersecurity may seem like an extremely complex issue, we all have a part to play, a part to play in safeguarding it. Not many of us are familiar with some of the terms, phishing, malware, encryption, but we all ought to be part of the solution. As individuals and organizations, we can be mindful of the basic aspects of cybersecurity in our day-to-day -day activities, and therefore strive to incorporate basic safety precautions in our routines. And business owners, I believe, must show leadership in that regard, because they, essentially remain the prime targets for cybercrime. There are instances, so many instances, where business have been targeted by cyber criminals, and as a result, they have lost billions of dollars in the process. We, at the National Security Ministry, consider this Cyber Security Awareness Month a crucial component in our fight against cybercrime. And we believe it presents the opportunity for us to play our role as responsible citizens and businesses towards keeping Ghana's cyberspace safe from all forms of threats. Ask me what are the major security challenges of our country. I will mention a couple of them, and trust me, cybersecurity will certainly be one of the key security challenges that we face. Mm -hmm.